What's happening, guys? Okay, so um, I actually got a question from uh, my Facebook page. Uh, some of you may be watching this video because you, I, if you hear an echo, it's because I'm outside my house, and for some reason, there's an echo out here. Um, and uh, I started a Facebook page, and I've been getting a, a lot of cool traction on it, and people are actually sharing my stuff and messaging, and I truly, like, I really appreciate that. I think that's super amazing. Like, when somebody shares my stuff, it's, like, the biggest compliment. It's, like, bigger than a comment, bigger than a, a like or anything, because you actually shared it. You know, that's, that's pretty sweet. Um, so keep doing that. Anyway, um, but I think uh, Jason McIntyre, I don't know how to uh, do editing, so or else I would do, like, a cool little pop-up of, like, your name and your face and everything on this video, but I don't know how to do it, so. Um, anyway, you sent me a message, it was really cool, a private message asking how uh, I would deal with uh, letting go of an employee who is like a relative. Now, here's something kind of not really in my expertise because I don't, I mean, I've got people who cold call for me who are friends, but um, I mean, I've never really had to deal with that exact situation. So I couldn't give advice um, probably as good as somebody else, but I'll give you my two cents on it and maybe it'll help you out. So what I think is um, if you, you know, here, I'll give you a situation. I actually used to work, uh, I won't say where, uh, but uh, at a, I actually used to work for a good friend. I was a, kind of a free employee, um, but he taught me a lot of good stuff skill-wise, so it was good. Um, and uh, we had a, a kind of a, the whole team had a little, uh, there, there's a lot of drama going on and some people had to get fired. And, uh, you know, I told the, my boss, my friend, I was like, look, straight up, if you have to fire people and let's say I am one of them, don't worry. I don't want you to think it's going to jeopardize our friendship. I'm still going to be cool with you. I understand business is business. Just give me a real reason so I know what happened um, so I don't fuck up in the future. But like. I totally get it, so don't worry about it. And I remember sending that in an email to him, um, and I, that's kind of my approach. That's kind of what I think. If in reverse, if you have a, uh, if you're the boss and your cousin, your brother, your whoever is your employee, then I think if they're really like your friend, or if they're really going to be cool with you, then they're going to understand business is business. And as long as you got a legitimate reason, like let's say they're really messing up and you're not able to make money or anything like that, and you're screwing up, they're fucking up or whatever, then you got to let them go. Give them a legit reason, you know, just sit them down, be cool, be real. And, um, and that's it. You know, I think that's, I mean, that's my two cents. You, it's a cancer. If they're a cancer to your business and you've got to eliminate them, you can't let your emotions rule your decisions and fuck you up because then you will get screwed up. So fire them, let them know why. And, uh, and you know, maybe suggest what they can do after, but that's my two cents. So Hopefully that helped you out, man. I wish I could throw up like a uh, a little bubble with your name on it. Maybe in the future, if I can actually get some traction on this, I'll get some video editors to do that for me. Damn, so many flies out here. Um, anyway, if you guys have actually any questions, I never even thought about this, send them in or comment. That would actually be cooler. Um, and I'll go ahead and make videos for these and respond to you. Take care, guys. Keep kicking ass.